Greetings family, welcome back to my channel. You know, in this video, I want to discuss some recent events pertaining to Jaguar Wright. You know, as you all know, Jaguar Wright is the former backup singer for Jay-Z. She also worked with The Roots, a numerous hip-hop entertainer. But as of late, she's come out revealing several little-known secrets about what happens in the music industry. She's actually said that the music industry seems to be some kind of labyrinth of child molesters and people who are actually unscrupulous business partners. All right. She's alluded to many stories of things that we've never gotten any um, clarity about. Uh, she says that people like The Roots, Common, P. Diddy, and several other hip hop entertainers and moguls have actually taken advantage of not only their label mates and artists, but also even the fans who sometimes come to their events. Okay. Well, basically, she has even related many of these people to Harvey Epstein and several sex trafficking allegations that have already been leveled against various stars. In my opinion, she's actually been saying some things that are consistent with not only public opinion, but actual um, persons who have actually been indicted for these types of situations. But basically, what I wanted to talk about in this video is the consistent smear campaign that is coming from Talib Kweli relating to her revelations. Okay? Now, Talib Kweli basically had a conversation with Lord Jamar, and I saw some additional footage. And in the footage, he's actually referring to an affair that he had with Jaguar Wright while she was married you know it seems to me that people will spare no expense and no effort when they try to destroy the character of a black woman and Talib Kweli portrays himself as a thinker on Twitter but the reality is the brother appears to be working along with whatever design that Jaguar Wright is exposing you know, it seems to me that people have mobilized Talib Kweli in the interest of um, trying to silence her. You know, because these allegations, he, as he started from like a week ago, where he actually started to expose some of their dealings from the past. You know, and he actually went on a tirade trying to discredit her uh, for his listeners. So I think it's really low, it's really a despicable act when you have two black brothers who will have a whole show disparaging members of the black community, namely our sister Jaguar Wright. You know, I thought Lord Jamar wanted to make a departure from DJ Vlad so he can represent a more consistent and a more authentic commentator in the black community. And it seems to me that Lord Jamar is still peddling some of the same um, theories and he's using the same approach that DJ Vlad is using. Because, you know, Lord Jamar started to have some more conscious interviews with individuals uh, like Umar Johnson. Um, I think he spoke with Talib Kweli on his last show. You know, and it was on this show that both of them actually were taking turns um, speaking negatively about the sister and also spreading rumors about what would have happened while she was married. You know, so I support the sister. Let me know what your thoughts are in the comments below about all these dynamics. One love.